Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. CJ. The title of our project is Solution to Improve a Road User Awareness and Behavior Modification. Our product name is the Safety Blinker Jacket. The name our is the name of our instructor is Encik Muhammad Kamal bin Musa dan Encik Muhammad Hidayat bin Abdul Rahman. Okay. This is our team members. Uh, leader, we have Nurul Afiqah binti Zulkifli and the assistant leader is Muhammad Zulkarnain Azwa bin Zulkifli and on the technical side, we have uh, Muhammad Ashraf Abu Qasim uh, me and on the design, the project design, Muhammad Zul Hakimi bin Salim and the process engineer of our project is Mar Marisatul Marisa bin Abu Hashim <coughs> Okay, introduction. Reflective blinkers jacket adopts innovative safety device mechanism. Okay, this safety blinkers jacket is to to uh, to prevent the user being careless and to to get the motorcycle being noticed by any other road user in any condition. <coughs> Prevent the driver from careless. This is our main objective and help road user to apply safety behavior. In the heavy rain, it's the most important because easily to, the, to other road user to notice and we can decrease the percent of the accident. And back to the previous slide, we have the reflect LED light receiver controller to receive the signal of the blinker. On the on the back of the safety vest, we have the LED light, which is uh, uh, left or right, and it reflect the light comes from the environment, and at the same time, will able to give blinker signal, so that the other user, road user, especially vehicle driver, to notice far from the side of the road. Okay, it can be used for motorcycle cyclist or even the airport land worker. <clears throat> this is the most uh, um, important material and part of our product, which is LED strap or LED light. Okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm Muhammad Zekana Azwa Bin Zikifli. Today I will be presenting about product project management for this blinkers jacket uh, so for opportunity identification as we all know the number of accidents in Malaysia are on the upward trend with more than half million cases recorded in 2018 uh, the most accident involved was uh, motorcyclists uh, where more than 4,000 in a single year for the past 10 years it is because motorcycle is a popular alternative to a four-wheel vehicle in Malaysia. Uh, so there are solutions that have been made uh, to prevent another casualties road death involving motorcyclists. So this is our product planning. Uh, there are opportunity funnels there are eight opportunity funnels begin with observation through statistic of road crash that caused by human factor in Malaysia and then uh, the second is uh, develop a team of benchmarking then uh, we create a, a proposal uh, and then we make uh, some survey uh, with a Google form and then uh, we make a project uh, specification and then we evaluate and prioritize what is the uh, most important and then we present it so for the competitive uh, strategy there are three types of uh, strategy the first is cost focus strategy Second is differentiation focus strategy, and the third is differentiation leadership strategy. 
So for the complete free product, uh, there's a general product vision statement. It is to improvise uh, the safety jacket with a set of blinkers to be used by the motorcycle rider in order to deliver road safety practice awareness. So for the mission statement, there is a product descriptions, key business goal, primary market, secondary market, and assumption and constraints. So as you can see, this is our uh, Google form for survey. Uh, so we got uh, 60 responses from uh, civ civilians uh, that uh, root users. So there's a question for the customer need statement. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nurul Afika binti Zulkifli and today I am going to present about the house of quality for the safety blinkers jacket. Okay, from the uh, customer requirement, we have a few features that uh, should be uh, taken care of such as easy to dry, the price, size, weight, color, expected life and the quality. Uh, followed by the uh, Washable, affordable price, fit to body which is relatable to the size, lightweight, uh, the bright color jacket, durability, high quality material and, and the competitive uh, or the supplier that we have surveyed which is safety pro and safety vest and the height. Okay, For, uh, here we can see that uh, the customer uh, choose the fit to body features uh, with followed by the durability and the high quality material, material for the jacket which uh, the raw score is 27 followed by 23 and 33 for the high quality material of the jacket here we can conclude that customers are more choosing the quality of the safety jacket uh, according to the customer requirement ok and then move Move to the final product specification. We have three big components that uh, we taken care of, which is safety vest, LED light, uh, remote and receiver. Okay, for the safety vest, we choose a nylon material where it can be used using a light rain weather. And then the color is yellow as per customer requirement before and then the weight also 250 gram uh, which is lightweight and then uh, additional description of for this vest is this vest uh, comes with a quality strap which we can fit the vest to the body as uh, what customer requirement um, before and then uh, this vest is also customized with a uh, with an insulated pocket where we can put the electronic device uh, without worry and follow the safety regulation after that the led light we choose led light strip where it make it easier to be traded onto the surface of the safety jacket safety vest and the aluminium gallium and the arsenide is uh, the material for the uh, LED light. The color that will be uh, lights is red and then the volt also uh, quite minimum uh, for safety purpose because uh, it will be attached to the body of the user. Uh, and it is also waterproof uh, because it have some uh, plastic features uh, onto the LED strip. Okay, move to the remote and receiver. Uh, the material is made of ABS plastic uh, and then the color is white. It is also, uh, it support uh, about uh, 60 hertz oscillation of frequency. It can be used uh, quite far from uh, the receiver. Okay. Uh, okay. Move to the bill of material. 
the stock good status is the work in progress uh, WIP where uh, the process flow is stitching and assembly uh, of the LED light uh, the receiver to the uh, stitching and assembly the pipe to the safety jacket okay, the main power uh, it took one main power to complete uh, the assembly process and then uh, the raw material in this uh, WIP progress is uh, safety vest LED strip light the receiver and the emitter which is uh, known as the remote uh, okay for the safety vest the color code is fluorescent but uh, the base is yellow as per customer requirement comes with a LED strip light which is red in color and the receiver and emitter is both white in color the supplier for the safety vest is TLS Enterprise the LED strip light is uh, Kuto and ECBB for the remote control the price per unit for the vest is 20 ringgit and then the LED strip light is 5 ringgit per unit comes with uh, receiver and emitter which is remote control is uh, 10 ringgit per unit and then uh, the packing material uh, as per packaging we use a zip lock plastic storage to make uh, easier use, use of uh, storage and packing for the user it also can be reused uh, many times because it comes with a zip lock features the supply is from Lazada and the price per unit for the Ziploc is five ringgit and thirty cents. Okay, now come to the target cost for safety blinkers jacket interactive. For the direct cost, we calculate the material cost, machine cost and labor cost. So the material cost including the packing material which is the Ziploc. The total is 55 ringgit 30 cent per unit okay and then calculate the machine cost uh, including the machinery break even and the hours it costs uh, 2 ringgit 84 cent per hour for the machine cost and then the labor cost is uh, working days 22 days per month 8 hours per day uh, as an assumption okay the salary is 90 ringgit per month so we get 5 ringgit and 60 cent per hour for the labor cost after that uh, for the indirect cost we take 30 percent from the direct cost as the overhead assumption uh, like electrical and uh, the the bills the other bills is overhead assumption so it took us about 90 ringgit and 30 cent per unit and then uh, the total cost is the direct cost before plus the indirect cost which uh, give us about 82 ringgit and 90 cent per unit okay that is only the total cost uh, comes with a uh, profit we take 30 percent of the total cost before where uh, it give 24 ringgit and 87 per unit which is uh, the profit we took from the total cost so the product price is the total cost of the overall process assembly and so ever uh, and plus with the profit, uh, profit that we calculate so it took us and it gave us 177 cents per unit for the product price okay so that is all uh, from me thank you
it is designed with a user friendly design for every age group of community. The concept creation for the function and sub function is shown in the table below. So this is half of quality of our product. So we move to the next slide. So for the weight cutting method, as you can see here, uh, we had highlight some information that we use in our jacket. For the vest, we use material nylon, uh, metal waterproof. Yes, we use the function waterproof. The size variant uh, here for the wig uh, we use is 0.3 kg to 0.4 kg. Base color green orange. For the blinker lamp type we use is LED power supply. Battery 850 mA. For the sign pattern we use left, right, forward and stop. For the recyclable is the function is recyclable. For the control we use is remote control and wireless frequency 2.4 kHz. So for the next slide. So this is a product driving and assembly. Um, this is a third angle projection of engineering driving uh, after we assemble the part. Uh, this is a front view, uh, this is a top view and this is a side view. So I will show you the simulation how the part assemble to the jacket okay let's see so this is this is a sensor and this is a led okay so i so that's all for me um, before i leave the presentation I will move the next slide to the next uh, presenter. Thank you. Hello, Assalamualaikum and very good morning. I am Masa Tumar Yusra binti Abu Hashim. And for today, uh, for this slide presentation for Bumpy Jacket, I will be presenting slide 16 until slide 18. Okay, so... Uh, as continuous from previous one which is product drawing and assembly that already been explained our final product is this this one so as you can see here we have three item number and the description is labeled here so this one for part one this uh, as you can see this is our safety blanket jacket uh, base and this one is LED pipe which consists of three components and also for this one is sensor okay so this is our final product that we have designed uh, okay and then for the next slide this one is intellectual property I will be explaining about this product target specification okay so for the next number we have one and two which is for safety accessory device that we choose uh, which is LED blinkers jacket uh, for, for LED for blinkers and for needs number 3 and 10 which is reflective jacket material we what we the target value and direction that we focus on is for the design and material issues for needs number 4 and 9, the target spe specification is transparent with color and strong. So the target values and direction that we choose is material, which is the strength, 
uh, the higher the better that uh, regarding of to this transparency with colors that is strong which is um, vibrant color that we choose uh, before lah, which is green and also orange and for the needs number 5 and 11 is affordable price for the target values and direction uh, for the ringgit Malaysia is lower the better that already explained uh, in the previous slide uh, during the price discussion in the previous slide so for the needs number 6 for target specification uh, is zero maintenance which is the lower the better so as for this blinker jacket it is durable uh, the quality is good and doesn't need um, maintenance uh, like constant maintenance for needs number seven and eight uh, the target specification is flexible size and insulated material and the target values and direction here is the design and material properties Lastly, for the needs number 12, which is rechargeable, uh, this one for the target values and direction is properties electronic issue. Uh, referring back to the description of pipe, which is LED and sensor. Okay, so as for the conclusion here, for the safety road user, the safety blinker jacket is recommended because nowadays people take the role of the safety road for granted. This product is one of the solution prevent another road death involving motorcyclists are in English much needed. Lastly, by using the safety blinker jacket will increase the awareness and motivation to adopt safer practices and habits. So this is the conclusion for the for our project that we already done for during this semester which is blinker jacket uh, blinker safety jacket that actually focus on uh, first to reduce the uh, road accident uh, and even death regarding of that uh, especially for motorcyclists okay that's all thank you so much